<laughs> just dump the chips. That would save you some volume. No. Necessary. No. No. This is not even a not even question. Where's that gonna go? It's not. <laughs> so what do we see up there? I see some snow. Um, I don't know what those are called, but they look cool. We take the upper lake to Astor Lake route, and that's our day. Yeah, we skirt yeah. there, and then we cut between the giant like face there and the thing. Yeah, yeah exactly. Yeah. And then Hidden Lake is obscured Hidden. somewhere. Yeah. We are loaded up and ready to go. Yeah, that's good. I'm not sure what that's all about. Because we went, uh, we drove a little bit farther than we thought. You did say it looked like Nepal. I think this is our trail. <laughs> this? No. Now we gotta go this way. Okay. Bear, bear, bear. Reminds me of like Yosemite or something. <sighs> Giant walls of rock with lush forest. Wow. This is amazing. Oh, the sign. The Alberta Park sign. This is where they scare you. They put a picture of a polar bear instead of a regular bear. <laughs> <laughs> you better put that in your video. Oh, God. Like, yeah. With an arrow point. I, I Not have... actual polar bear. Difficult exposed terrain and route findings. My jam. Secret garden by the hidden lake. I love it. I wonder if the risk of, like that Kananaskis 10 centimeters of snow at 2200 meters scared off everyone who's supposed to camp here with us. Yeah. And it's just us. Oh, you see all the waterfalls? Uh, yeah. I didn't even see that before. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That is so big. And I guess that's Fossil Falls. Very nice. Just the colors are right. Oh, everything's right. Except the wind and the temperature and the this and the that. But still. And the snow and the sleet and the rain and the... But it's still awesome. Okay, so we've made it to Astor Lake, which is behind me. Um, we're gonna do a little crevasse rescue practice. Oh yeah, I don't think I've said what we're doing yet in this video. We're gonna try to summit Mount Joffrey, one of the 11,000 or And I know that the glacier's in bad shape from the hot summer, so we brought ice screws in case we have to pitch out North Face Glacier. It's a beautiful area here, as you can see. Uh, we are just, just below the, tr the snow line. The relief of these mountains is extraordinary. Uh, yeah, that wraps up day one of the Joffrey Expedition. What the hell do I get down? How did I get up here? God, I'm going to die trying to get back to camp here. We will hopefully summit Joffrey. Meep. <laughs> I want to howl. Howl! What's that, Michael? I'll shut up so the audio's not in the shot. <laughs> Chez hey. la Grande Montagne. What the hell's the thing? Oh, that's unnamed. It's beautiful. That's part of Joffrey. Holy crap. Whoa. That is not what the pictures look like. <laughs> <laughs> Woo. Holy cow. <laughs> what have we signed up for? <laughs> Imagine it was like manga paragraph. We're a little lost here. <laughs> Holy cow. Yeah, we'll punching a bit above our weight for manga. <laughs> we might be punching above our weight for Joffrey. <laughs> okay. Did it wet through? I guess you don't know yet. If it did, not a whole bunch. Okay. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Mikey on the lead, talking to his YouTube army. That's where we came from. 
about four kilometers from our camp there. We got eight kilometers to go and at least a thousand meters up, so we're not so close yet. All right, so we're coming up the side, a uh, little bit of moraine here. Uh, that's the unnamed peak connected to Joffrey, so we're going between that and that chunk of bedrock there. Uh, we're going to stay in the snow here and contour. and it feels very big because it is very big. Can't see Joffrey, the actual peak right now. It's uh, in cloud, so we'll see how the visibility is when we get up there. Too bad that video is not going to show how steep this is. Never does, does it? Snow was consolidated enough and it did it in the spring. Okay, so we've gained the Manjin Glacier. Uh, we're, I'm talking to my phone. We're roped up and uh, making our way up to the steeper slope. Joffrey is in the clouds there. It looks to me like everything that's crevassed is visible. Uh, so that'll be nice. So we have good glacier conditions for getting our points in and good visibility in terms of dry, glacier dryness and not being bridged. Obviously much farther than it looks. Uh, that is a giant wall of ice in front of us. Um, so we'll see how long this takes us. But uh, we got lots of daylight Let's still. Why? Are you good? I'm good. Okay. Jerry's good in there in the back. Caboose is ready to go. Okay, the excitement continues. Um, we crossed, well, I crossed the Bergstrom. Nate's gonna try to cross the Bergstrom. Um, there's this ice bridge, but uh, it's hard to get to deep snow. So we pitched it out, and now the rest of this is very steep. Um, unfortunately, to cross the Bergstrom, we had to come to the side here because it was just gaping everywhere. All right, Jerry. Oh, wait, hold on one sec, one sec. I'm, interesting. I'm yeah, I know. <laughs> but uh, yeah, we'll see what happens here. Look at that, look at the snow there. That's coming in. Look at that Berkshire nut there though, eh? I know! We crossed that. I don't know how. <laughs> Look at the side there. Like we were like perched on that side. Come on, old girl. Or boy or lieutenant in the World War II, whatever you were. He was a lieutenant. Winter is coming. Winter's here. <laughs> what do you mean yeah. winter's coming? <laughs> winter's been all over us for the last nine hours. Yeah, my feet kind of feel it. good decisions. Good try. That was really good. off of the glacier and then down from the glacier on the moraine to the bivy the high bivy site it's rough going but we're doing good 
Everything was covered in ice this morning and now it's kind of melted off. Yeah, so obviously we didn't summit, but we've discussed it numerous times that we made the right call and to pitch out those upper pitches of ice, 40, 50 degrees. It's hard. Crossing the berg showing we had to traverse way right. Too bad we didn't summit, but uh, I don't think either of us are upset about it. So that's the way to be. And uh, we're almost back at camp and we're both excited for dinner. So sounds pretty good to me. So that's our attempt on Joffrey. Yeah, it was a good day. We had a lot of fun. I used a lot of uh, skills I haven't used in a while. Multi-pitch alpine ice, uh, V-threads. Haven't made a V-thread in two years. All manner of fun stuff. It was a great day. Lots of good skills and learning and group finding and all the stuff you want to do when you're out here. So, great day. Awesome day. Huh. Good to be out. Always good to be out.